Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this video I want to have one final comment about uh, using uh, pixel art inside of Unity to make it actually import into your project and look good while it's doing it. So right here we're looking at a 32 pixel by 32 pixel sprite and it comes in perfectly. Oh, with some of the other sprites I, I was doing in earlier videos today, uh, mip mapping seemed like a decent alternative. But at the end of the day, if you're working with uh, sprites that have a very low size, like you can see this entire uh, file is like 32 kilobytes, um, then an option might just be to turn compression off entirely. So let me show you what it looked like before I had compression turned off. You can see that um, basically wherever the colors try, try to change from one area to another, it gets uh, kind of distorted in its colors because I'm, I'm guessing it takes a sampling of the colors from different areas and um, for the sake of compression kind of fuses those together to get in between colors. Not an expert on compression or anything. But if you turn that off, then it won't reduce the size. So it's going from 32 kilobytes I mean, 8 kilobytes up to 32 kilobytes um, in its file size for the actual project. But it does get 100% of the detail um, that you're going to be looking for in your sprite for pixel art based game. So if you're getting that kind of issue on low resolution sprites, then what you should do is go find the image file. Um, for your sprite inside of Unity. Scroll down to the bottom past advanced settings and filter mode, which by the way I would probably say should be uh, point filtering rather than bilinear. You can see the difference right there. Uh, and just turn compression off down here and that's an easy way to make sure that you get a hundred percent of the detail and it looks exactly like it did in your pixel art editor. So here we can see uh, I'm using pixel edit and looks the same and that's what we want. So hope that helps you out there if you're trying to do pixel art based games inside of Unity. And uh, just kind of FYI, from my experience, uh, having Heart Battle pretty close to done now, I would say Unity may have not been the perfect system for uh, 2D sprite based games, but uh, you can always work around the system. So in any case, I've been Chris. Thanks for watching. Hope this video helps some of you guys out there and hopefully I'll see you guys in my future content. Till then.